Washing your hands unidirectionally simply means moving in one direction and not returning the other way. I want you to picture your hands like the color of the rainbows, starting at the red with your fingertips, working all the way down to your elbows, be it the last color pink. Think of it as small little bands around each area of your hand that you have to complete before moving down that rainbow down towards your elbows, but never returning back up to your fingertips. Your fingertips must remain as clean as possible at all times. So once we're done cleaning them, we really shouldn't be using them to clean anything else. Step one is your fingernails, fingertips, and cuticles. Make sure you cover each fingertip and nail all the way down to the cuticle. Bacteria tends to harbor there. Ensure that you finish each step on both hands before moving down. This helps us not miss an area during any point of our hand washing and forearm hygiene. Scratch each thumbnail and fingernails into the palm of the opposite hand to ensure the soap is pushed underneath the fingernail and that our fingernails are the cleanest that they can be. Grab each thumb and fingers and grasp them in the palm of the opposite hands and twist. This ensures that our knuckles and each individual finger is thoroughly cleaned with the soap. Ensure you clean the webs of your fingers and your thumb from both directions thoroughly. Following cleaning your palm while twisting it over, doing the fronts of your hands all the way up to your knuckle area and back again. Use a small circular motion for cleaning. You'll notice here that the fingertips are being held back. That's important at this point to make sure that we do not recontaminate our fingers. Now you're going to circle your wrists and work your way up towards your elbow. This is where you're going to think of those rainbow bands to do small circular motions in band red, small circular motion in band orange, etc. Working your way all the way down to your elbows, not using your fingertips. Rinsing, you want to take your time with this, allowing the water to constantly run from your fingertips down to your elbow. So you want your fingers to be raised higher than your elbow. Twist your hand under the water to ensure you're getting all the soap off. Not to worry if you miss a bit, you can come back through as long as your elbow is below and your hand is raised above. Water should always be dripping off of your elbow. Avoid the urge to flick. It is important we don't flick as this can make contaminated water past our elbow come up and recontaminate our hands. When you are drying your hands, you want to dry them unidirectionally, starting at your fingertips of one hand, patting dry. Don't rub as this can be abrasive to our skin, especially when we wash them so often. Pat dry all the way down from our fingertips to our elbows, unidirectionally, not going back up. Again, think about those rainbow bands. If you don't have a hands-free sink, you may use a clean paper towel to turn off of your sinks 
and discard, making sure not to touch the faucet with your cleaned hands.